Well, mostly what I like to do is just collect cool old stuff. And I guess this kind of qualifies. This is a Frank Mossberg early socket set. This one probably from about 1918 to 1922, somewhere around in there. These were the first socket sets that you could buy to work on your car or your carriage, as the case may be in those days. And uh, this one is fairly complete. There's a few empty spots in there. Don't really know if there were sockets there or they were just left empty. Then it has the early ratchet. You can see right on there. Frank Mossberg and Company, Attleboro, Massachusetts, USA. This, this, well, I don't know if they actually called it a ratchet back then, but though it is, still works beautifully too. Just like intended, you can still use this as tools if you wanted to. Patented in 1913. These kits, I believe, go back to about 1910. All different size kits. Some had more sockets than others, different attachments. This is the big set. It has, you know, the universal. It's got the, uh, the breaker bar. That's this. It's got uh, this, actually. It's your extension. And there's your breaker bar. <laughs> I guess they were sort of inventing it as they went along. Now, these are pressed steel. You know, these are not broached like the later sockets would be. But in an era when you pretty much just had adjustable wrenches to work on stuff and some open-end wrenches and whatnot, uh, this was pretty, pretty revolutionary. That's the Mossberg stamp on it. Not to be confused with Mossberg shotgun. That was a different Mossberg. But the Frank Mossberg Company was around, I believe, up close to the late 20s before it was folded into one of the other big manufacturers. This tool, I don't believe, this is some kind of a sock, uh, spark plug socket or whatever. This does not actually go with the kit, but it was in it. So, And so was this very early, see if I can find where it says it, very early snap-on socket was in here. This is one of the very first snap-on sockets. Or, you know, type of snap-on socket. Now, this, is, this one's the 1930 seconds, but that definitely dates to at least the 1920s. Why it was with the kit, I don't know. Because there is a 1930 seconds in there. Maybe it was just lying around and someone decided, let's get rid of it. Came in a nice wooden box. You don't see that anymore. That's for sure. Well, you do, but you see it like in the presentation stuff that no one actually uses as tools. You know, Snap-on gives out those occasionally, the gold-plated ratchets and all that kind of thing. See your square nut sockets there. Working on all your carriage bolts. And these are not sizes you would normally see. Well, that's a... What do we got here? This is the... Uh, whoops. Can't really read that. Oh, here we go. 31 30 seconds. 31 30 seconds. I guess they really hadn't standardized fasteners by that point. That would come later. There's a lot of fractional sizes in here. That's a 7 8. That's a normal size. Or normal as we would know it, the 1 inch. And yeah, that one we know today. 1 and 1 30 second. Now, we don't know that one today. That's definitely something you'd have to go back 100 years to really have a use for. But being that I work on a lot of really old stuff, it's good to have these. But this is going to be displayed in my Model A or my Model T anyway. This is uh, not a toolkit I actually intend to use, although I could. There's nothing that would stop me from using it. It's, everything is actually in very good condition. The phosphating is still on there. They really aren't worn. Whoever had this probably used it a few times when the car broke and uh, didn't really mash it too much. You can see they're all in pretty good shape. Because I've seen quite a few of these kits that show signs of very heavy use. But uh, this isn't one of them. Nice oak box. I like that. It's too bad they don't go back to that. You know, just every now and then for a nice little set of sockets or something. And there you go. A look at the Frank Mossberg socket set. This is what all of your Snap-on Mac Matco Craftsman socket sets of today come from. This is where it originated. Right here. All those $100,000 toolkits you got out in your bay. Yeah, all started with something like this or with this. And it all went on from there.
cool old stuff.